Hold up. Alright, what's going on guys? Mr. Clasher here. Welcome back to another Clash of Clans gameplay commentary. And I've been trying to record this for a couple of times previously, so we're going to make this video a little bit shorter than I intended to because my iPhone is about to die. But anyway, so first of all, I do have an awesome revenge raid I did on this player named Kayo. I believe that's how you pronounce it. So he took 9 trophies away from me, but um, I actually had GoWeeWee trained because we're having the war pretty soon. And I was like, you know what? There's six hours left, and I could actually go raid, so. Anyway, looks like I do drop one archer right there, and I was actually um, kind of nervous on attacking this player because of that Inferno Tower right near the core of the base. You know, I was just thinking, you know what, if I do lose this raid, I will only lose five trophies. So, I was like, you know what, let's go for it. So, I do drop two golems on the top left and right side of the base. And these bases are pretty easy to go up and go with me because um, you can just destroy them pretty easily. And thankfully, I knew this player didn't have any giant bombs near that corner because um, the, all the, I guess, compartments were had just enough room to fit like a spring trap or something. Not enough for a giant bomb. It wasn't by 2x2, two two, so... Anyway, I do drop that jump spell and this raid is pretty fast. My troops move quickly into the core of the base and looks like my king is going to take all that gold from this player away. So um, that wasn't the best jump spell placement but it was pretty good just to get inside um, the core. All my troops did destroy the town hall so I was pretty happy and from this point I was just hoping for a 2 star looks like I'm at 43%. I do have a couple of witches alive but they're going to die pretty quickly because of those multi set inferno towers. So it looks like my queen is just destroying the wall like she likes to do a lot. And let's speed this up a little bit. So I have not used her ability, but I am going to use the ability right there to destroy that mortar and the elixir storage just about there. It looks like I'm at 49% and I do have a spell which I could have placed anywhere right there. But I did have a couple archers I saved because I do carry around anywhere from 5 to 8 archers with go wipe or go wee wee. Just in case of these moments to get me to, to the 2 star which um, is actually got me a lot more trophies if I didn't actually get two stars. So overall, not too bad of a raid, I think. And yeah, so let's go back home real quick. So I took 34 trophies from that guy. Thank you very much. And uh, let's donate a couple more troops. I actually need to start making my army, which I'm actually going to do right now. So I'm going to make a golem, three witches, and another three witches. So... Yeah, I'm going to start making my army right now, and we're going to go show a couple of replays from our clan. So let's go check it out real quick. Um, Let's go check out Tex. So this was actually an interesting raid by Tech, and let's see what he did. So he's going to drop a couple of barbs and wizards. Not sure what that was for, but he does drop the king and the queen. Uses the ability very, very soon for the king. And he's going to start his attack pretty soon right here. So anyway, let's yeah. Okay, so he drops the Lava Hound and does drop a Rage Spell. I think he sends about six balloons on that side, I believe, or seven or something. So destroys that air defense. And I think he was going for both of the air defenses because from that point on, it was pretty easy. And I think I know what he's trying to do um, in this raid for sure. I actually kind of do know what he's doing. So he's just practicing his raids for uh, yeah for the war. So anyway, it looks like the balloons are gonna be an easy three star from this point, uh, or at least it looks like. And yeah, so three star, good job by Tech. Let's speed this up a little bit. Um, anyway, guys, hope you did enjoy this quick short video. Um, I will have a war recap pretty soon once we do finish the war. So anyway, it looks like the balloons are gonna destroy things very slowly. The pops are going around the base. Look at them, they're so tiny. I mean, look at them. Man, that's just, they're really cute. I don't know why, but <laughs> they're just little tiny pups trying to do their best um, to destroy things. Um, I think they're like the smallest troop beside the goblins. So, anyway, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe. Wish us luck in the war. Um, hopefully we're going to win. But anyway, if we could smash 40 likes for this video, that would be awesome. And as always, I'll see you all on my